Hello, my fabulous fashionistas. Hold on a second, it's kind of hot in here. Surprise! Yes, everyone, I was wearing a wig. Um, I got this brown one because I kind of wanted to switch up the look, and again, like I said in my other video, a lot of my friends from high school wanted to see what I looked like with brown hair, and that's kind of why I wanted all of your opinion to see which hair color I looked better because I kind of wanted to try it out before doing anything drastic and having to go and dye my hair and then having to worry about dyeing it back to blonde and trying to get this exact color and if I didn't like it brown then I just wouldn't want to have to go back and re-dye it. So a lot of you guys had been commenting saying that the brown hair looked good so who knows maybe I will end up dyeing it brown but for now I just kind of thought it would be a fun little thing to do different looks with different color hairstyles. I also really want to get a black wig um, because there's going to be some things that I'm going to do with the different hairstyles. So that's coming up. <laughs> Looks so weird when I hold it. Ooh. Um, but yeah, so I'm probably going to just switch up different looks and kind of just keep my natural hair and use the wig for certain looks. And if I get the black one, just kind of switch up looks because hey, I mean, we change clothes, right? So why not change hair colors? I don't know, what do you guys think? Should I do different looks with different hairstyles, different colors? Because I thought that'd be kind of fun. I might get one with like short hair to see how that one looks, but I don't know. I just wanted to throw that out there. Anywho's, on to the video. Okay, so today I wanted to do a Marshalls haul. And for those of you that have seen my Trendy Tuesday videos, a lot of the outfits that I put together have been um, outfits that I have gotten from Marshalls because you'd be surprised if you go to Marshalls they have really really good deals and really really cute clothes and they may just look like articles of clothing, a shirt and a pair of pants but if you go home and kind of mix and match it with different things that you already have in your closet you'd be surprised what kind of really really cute outfits you can come up with. Okay so let's get started. First off um, I got a pair of socks like a bunch of different colored socks for sort of this whole new look thing that I'm going with, the whole socks and sandals thing, which again may sound kind of crazy, but the last Trending Tuesdays episode that I did I wore socks and sandals and I feel like it's really just an acquired taste. It's kind of like food, if you try it out and you kind of get used to it, it's something that kind of grows on you, so I really thought that that was something that looked cute. I thought it was weird when I first saw it, but again I saw it on the mannequins in New York and and I just saw it in like magazines and things and just thought it would be fun to try out so I went out and bought some pairs of socks from Marshalls that I can kind of incorporate with different outfits. Just for kind of underneath like dresses or those little um, vest things I got this Ralph Lauren shirt and it's just like a plain white tee t-shirt but I thought it would be great just to have under different things. It's always good to have like a plain white shirt that you can just kind of mix and match with different things. And I already took the tag off of this one because I already wore it out. So this shirt was $12.99. So that's a pretty good deal. Okay, so the next thing that I got, I got these pair of skinny black jeans, which really come in handy. And they're really cute. They have these, their pockets I thought were really, really cute. And again, they're just black skinny jeans, so they look like this. And these pants were $14.99, so I thought that was also a really, really good deal. So they're really comfortable and really, really great material. This shirt might look familiar to you guys. This was the last Trendy Tuesdays episode that I um, put together. So this is that turtleneck shirt with the cute little buttons on the side, and it's short sleeves. And this is so cute. I'm definitely going to be wearing this with a lot, a lot of different outfits. So really, really cute shirt. You can match it with anything, with a pair of black skinny jeans, with regular skinny jeans, whatever. And again, with the episode that I did, I put them with the green shorts, which are right over here. And they're just, again, like short shorts, but the material is very good. And these ones can kind of stretch too. And they have, they have these little buttons for zipper. Then I got these um, khaki long pants, and these are also virtual stretch, and they were $14.99. And so they're just really, really nice, comfy 
khaki pants that I probably would just wear, and they're actually skinny. They're kind of skinny ones, so I kind of liked I liked that. Um, but this is just kind of for like a natural kind of you know look, or if you're going out to a school production or something. And also, um, I went to a public school in a private school. So for those of you guys that are in private school and you're only allowed to wear skirts and khaki pants, Marshalls has really, really great deals on comfortable pants that are khaki that you can wear for school. Or, you know, again, for those of us going to college, you can just wear it for, you know, your freshman induction or some kind of you know, school thing that you just want to wear a cute black top or, you know, something dressy that, that can just go with khaki pants. Okay, so this next shirt is probably going to be one of the lifesavers in college because as a freshman, I found that it is not exactly the easiest thing to actually take the time to wear cute things because you're just running around and you can't really wear cute shoes. So it's it takes a little bit more of effort to look cute in college and I noticed as a freshman that a lot of the girls kind of wore long shirts with leggings and Uggs or flats or something like that so for next year I bought three of these kinds of shirts they're one of those like big um, baggy and they're like one of those half sleeved ones and they're really cute they have like this little pattern here and again it goes kind of to where my knees are so I was thinking of just wearing one of these kinds of shirts with like a cami underneath some necklace you can dress it up with jewelry and cute earrings or whatever and basically what you do is just wear leggings and Uggs or something like that and it's really easy really fast to just you know if you have a morning class don't really want to spend too much time on what you want to look like just throw this on you can still look cute and it's easy PS ten dollars okay so while I'm on this topic let me just show you guys the other two shirts that I got that are kind of the same long shirt whatever look and this one is black and white and it looks like this and I really love the sleeves, the sleeves are so cute they already kind of cuffed them for you and they have a little button so it it keeps it over here, it keeps it halfway down your arm but I don't know, it, just, it looks really really cute on because also along the side of it, it kind of has the same thing this whole like pin up with a little button so when it when it's on and complemented with black leggings it looks so cute I will add this outfit to the next episode of Trending Tuesdays and I think what I'm gonna do is to just kinda show you guys as many back to school outfits as possible instead of just doing one outfit I'm gonna do two or three so that I can just show you um, again like different outfits that you can put together and kind of incorporate these things from Marshalls that I got and um, yeah okay again so I just got another one of these kinds of shirts because I really just feel like if you get a lot of the same type of shirt but just in different colors then you can mix and match it with different types of pants different legging colors whatever and you're not outfit repeating or anything so I just wanted to get as many of these types of shirts as possible because I really feel like in college I'm going to be using these for days when it's rainy and disgusting and I really just don't feel like getting all dressed up so this one is also blue but it's a little bit more similar to the black one because it has a little button that you can um, pull up your sleeves and it has cute little pockets so I thought it was really cute so in a way each of them are different but they're the same look so I just kind of wanted a wide variety of different types of these kinds of shirts Okay, so I'm really excited to show you guys these pants because I put together an outfit that looks so, so cute. And I'm really excited to show you, but they're these green pants and they look like this. And they're really skinny. They really, really hug the bottom of your ankles because they're really, really skinny. And there's actually a zipper here. And these pants were $16.99 in the junior section. And they are... Donna Karen New York jeans and they're adorable they're really really cute and I feel like you could just pretty much wear these with anything I love the fact that they're really skinny they hug your ankles so if you have a really cute pair of high heeled pumps or something like that it would look adorable because it's really really tight against your your ankle and then if you wear cute shoes they stick out and it looks awesome okay and the last pair of pants that I got is also a pair of jeans and they look like this and again, they are skinny jeans. 
And I really love the color. It's like a very deep navy blue. And it's always good to have these kind of jeans. So darker pants, they are $16.99. And, and again, so you can pretty much dress this up with anything. And I really, really like how they're dark because I also have a blue um, vest that I wanted to put with this. So this would look really cute if you wanted to dress it up with a cute pair of shoes. And again, that white shirt from the Ralph Lauren one that I was showing you guys, if you wanted to put that and then like a vest on top of that, I think that would look really cute. Just kind of finish off the look with accessories and, you know, your hair up in a high ponytail with a poof or something like that. I just thought that would be really cute. Okay, and the last thing that I got was a vest, and it looks like this, and it's really pretty. It has all these little, like, buckles and zippers and things, and it's adorable. It looks so nice, and the material is this really, really nice leather, and it was only $19.99, which is a very, very good deal. And so, again, stay tuned next week for a look with this because I'm going to be adding this also into next week's Trendy Tuesday because I came up with a really really cute outfit so I'm really excited to show you guys. Alright well thank you all so much for watching and I hope that you enjoyed and also really really quickly um, while I was going through my clothes through my closet I kind of put a pile of clothes together that don't really fit me anymore or that I don't necessarily wear as much anymore and they're really really nice clothes and it'd be a shame to throw them out and I also gave away a bunch of other clothes because the whole transition into college I kind of really had to sit myself down and go through my clothes that I really just know for a fact that don't fit or I would not wear anymore so I kind of want to leave this up to you guys I really wanted to do something different for my 500 subscriber contest I really just wanted to take whoever was my 500 subscriber and give all of those clothes to that particular person so what are your thoughts on that? Do you think that I should give away just certain pieces of this pile of clothing or give the whole thing to this person? Do you like the idea that I would do just the 500 subscriber or should I make a contest out of it? I really don't know what to do with these clothes but they're really cute and, and so I was just thinking that you guys are so awesome and I really appreciate your support and then I also just really wanted to give back. I just really wanted to kind of incorporate it into a contest so leave me some comments and let me know what you guys think about that because um, you know I'm just this idea is kind of just up in the air but this was something that I was thinking about so let me know what your feedback is and if you guys have like any other suggestions or whatever so please let me know okay well again thank you so much for watching I hope you're having a great day and a great summer and okay well again guys thank you so much for watching and I hope you're having a great day and a great summer thanks bye Thank you.